What is up guys and welcome to another episode of Day Reviews. Today you're going to be going over My Hero Academia chapter 311 titled Here We Go. Uh, before I start I just want to say Happy Mother's Day to all the mothers out there. I uh, hope you guys have a wonderful day. Uh, with that said, this chapter is going to be, or at least I'm going to try and get through this chapter as fast as I can because I got to get to my mom's house. Happy birth, happy uh, Mother's Day mom if you're seeing this, if you're watching this. She probably not, but I'll probably tell her to watch it. <laughs> So she seems to be saying it, but, but I'm going to just go ahead and hop into this. That is not what I expected to see or read. Somebody just firing off these shots, boy, and getting in there. Send a couple of people out there firing. Come on, you idiot. We better split up. Endeavor just sitting there behind the pillar. I'm gonna, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna harbor on the shitty dad that you are. <laughs> I'm and how Dobby is absolutely destroying your life. But, <laughs> but what I am gonna do, I'm gonna look at what he does as a hero. And right now, standing behind this pillar, oh, he's ready. <laughs> a nail gun support item <laughs> that's relatively dangerous, honestly. But it's overtuned for extreme capabilities. Damn it, Detnorak. And he rolls out of that bitch. <laughs> he rolls out of that bitch clean as fuck. Charges through. Ignited arrow. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. For as shitty as you are, that's a pit, bruh. <laughs> that arrow fucked him up. Now that's a fire attack. Ah, I mean, no, as a hero, even even Shoto's like, bruh, actually, as a hero, you out here, bruh. I'm not gonna lie. Currently, you're out here doing what you're supposed to do. I was like, ugh, <sighs> give me a break. You're the reason we're even out, Endeavor. <laughs> the villain has a point. That's why I'm here. The best genius says, more escaped convicts? Says, though none affiliate with him, I presume. Endeavor says, right. I mean, Hawks is there, too, in the whip. So, did somebody, f somebody throw something at Endeavor? A crowd of people <laughs> who seem quite upset. We don't take, we don't need fake heroes is one of the signs. As I got, and the other one I can't read. But, <clears throat> get out of here, you scum. Yeah. <laughs> Endeavor just got to look and take it, bruh. Says, if you hadn't let Shigaraki and his people get away... We wouldn't be dragging with all these escaped con or dealing with all these escaped convicts. It's not wrong. Hawk says we should go, Endeavor. Those kind, those media folks said <laughs> they were really letting them have it. Says those media folks said that Sugar Rocky was supposedly after someone else besides you people, which means you all are hiding, are still hiding something from us. And they're breaking it down, bro. <laughs> They're breaking it down! They're calling you out! Coward! The grieving relatives of the victims Dobby burned to ashes went on TV. Did you even see that? I didn't even think about that, bruh. I didn't even think about the relatives, bruh. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> oh no! Oh no, sign says my family faced the flames. Oh, damn. No. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Bruh, they're like, get out of here. Just seeing your face makes us hopeless all over again. You fakes, you got no right to show your face around here. Bruh, and they're talking to all of them. And that's the top three heroes. Endeavor, Hawks, Best Genius. They was like, we don't give a fuck. We don't give a fuck who you are. Fuck all y'all. Yeah, best genius trying to use the use his wires to stop the debris, the rainfall, of debris coming upon you. Endeavor, shoulders down, oh head down, like bro. I just, <laughs> I just, I don't know, bro. Why am I even here, Hawks? Why you got me out here, bro? I ain't have enough time to process the grief shit, bro. You got me out here. I had to tell them shit. I wasn't ready for none of that. You made me think I was. And I hear I... I mean, like I said, he's... It would be a... He wants to throw himself into his work, which is 
heroistics. But that's part of the reason why you're in the situation that you're in right now. So it's like, you don't have a real outlet, bro. You don't really have anybody to talk to because the people who are around you to talk to, it's like, you need a therapist. It's what you need, and you need some per some people in PR. You don't need Hawks, and you don't need Best Genius. For hero stuff, yeah. That other shit, as far as, like, help, like emotional help or, or really trying to change, they're not it, bro. <laughs> they're not it. Hawks says, yes, I see. Please keep up your search for the Liberation Front, Ed Shot. Says, no progress, huh? They got Ed Shot looking for him? That ain't who you want to show up nowhere, bro. He won't even announce himself. He's just piercing your lungs and saying, I took him out. Swiftly. One second. <laughs> no. Said it if he wanted to. If he wanted to, he can just he can just go inside somebody's brain, create like some spike shit on some sonic shit, and just all you hear is coins. I mean instead of coins, it's brain splattering. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> <laughs> says um should we let all, all might and Midoriya get another kilometer or two ahead of us if the media learns we're working with Midoriya too he's bound to get flack for it <sighs> you know they're gonna find out bro they're gonna find out Endeavor says yeah let's put a bit more distance between us no sense in giving Deku more to deal with sure He's the one who asked for this, but we're basically using the boy as bait to lure out the league, except those villains have gone to ground. Even that's fucked up, bruh. I mean, yeah, he asked for that, but you're not supposed to let him do it. <laughs> you're not supposed to let him do it. And then it's like a three-man mission. Eh, eh. And then when you lure out the league, bruh, like, the way they moving, you... No. <laughs> Y'all, no, bruh. We're assuming the escapees, the supervillains from Tartarus in particular, received orders of some kind. It's only logical that they'd use the greater confusion and chaos to keep a low profile while going after their target one for all. But heroes are fraying at the seams. If I were all for one... I will go on the offensive. Let's me know that you have a villain's mind. <laughs> Thanks, best genius. It must be like Deku said. Right now, his top priority might be hijacking Shigaraki. All Might destroyed him to the point that he needed to be connected to tubes to keep him alive. All Might tried to kill him. He just didn't finish the job. <laughs> and now, He's grooming Sugar Rocket to be some sort of ultimate life form. It would make sense if its goal is to take over that new body. It would, but the way he's talking, he's moving one way, <laughs> and he's talking another way. And I mean, and I mean it, that's that's part for the course with with all for one, but he still got his body, and. You wouldn't go through the the trouble of trying to teach this man lessons and learn lessons and talk about taking stuff from him unless you were literally just grooming grooming him to be your protege. I mean that the story is the the pretty much the the parallels between Deku and Shigaraki. It's like okay, All Might and All for One. All Might is out of the picture. All for One is in the background, but he's he's a He's a better sensei than All Might is, so he's actively doing more. Even if it's more forcefully, he's doing more for his, his protege than All Might is. Because All Might is just like, he don't know what the fuck he's doing. All for one, been at this for a while. He knows how the heroes operate. He's like, they operate off of willpower. I'm going to give you willpower, but the hatred willpower. Your willpower can be just as strong as their plus ultra bullshit because you have a lot of fucking hatred. And it's like, it's like, I want to groom that. It's like, be better than me. Be better than me is what I want. He's Tony Stark. He's like talking to Spider-Man. Be better. He's like, I didn't, I didn't want you to be uh, be me. I wanted you to be better. 
even if I had to take over myself. Otherwise, why would he break out his body? Instead of just leaving that bitch there. It wasn't doing nothing. If you're going to end up taking up, so you just got two bodies doing a fusion dance now? Now we are the ultimate one. I mean, that could be something too. I digress. <laughs> Says, according to Doc, Doc Garaki, who's in custody, Shigaraki was activated before his body was complete. We're unsure of the specifics of the potential body transfer, but it's clear that Shigaraki has to be complete for it to work at all. And then comes all for one's next goal. He'll be able to steal one for all. Something about that is bugging me. He says, oh, Midoriya and All Might explain to us how a body that's too weak can't receive it. Yeah, it makes sense that you need a young, strong body. But there was another element. What I don't get is why Shigaraki's rage is so essential. A strong emotion is key, no? After all, One for All contains eight other spirits. One needs strength of will to override them. I said that. This is what I'm saying. See, I, come on, bro. Come on. <laughs> come on. R.I.P. DMX. R.I.P. Brother. Says, but all for one has been pursuing his younger brother and one for all for generations. You'd expect the guy to hold on to plenty. But all for one has been pursuing his younger brother and one for all for generations. You'd expect the guy to hold on to plenty of hatred for all those other successors. Said maybe it's not enough hatred yet, or maybe he has none at all. It's just the impression I get, but. Think about it. That guy never stops smiling, right? It's hard. I can imagine it's hard to have hatred for somebody when not only are you manipulating them effectively, and you've been doing it for years, and you do it to multiple people, multiple people. You're usually right. Shit goes your way. <laughs> You're still standing. You're still here. You've been there for generations, bro. You've been on top. You've been on top except for when All Might was around, but you were still kind of on top. So yeah, it's still there. And it's like, I mean, you making moves, bro. You making moves, and who's stopping them? Like, nobody. <laughs> All of this is... is is my play thing. I'm having fun doing this shit. I get off on it. Effectively. It's like, I ain't got no hatred here for what? You know, I ruined my plans, but I mean, that's par for the course. Just learn from it. I got time. Y'all don't. And that's real. <laughs> At the end of the day, I'ma still be here. How many of y'all successors was is, did I run through? How many generations of motherfuckers have, have I outlived? It don't matter. We are what, eight, nine? Doesn't matter. All my on his last leg. He's definitely going to get got. Oh, yeah. That's another one. Scrap, uh, put, mark another one up for all for one. Because <laughs> I'm still here. <laughs> Says something's missing in his soul, huh? <laughs> he doesn't have one. <laughs> what are you talking about? It never... You would know! <laughs> Either way, these supervillains have no useful intel. Nothing that gives us any leads. How do you how do you get intel out of villains if you're not doing it Batman style? I'm just saying. If you ain't doing it Batman style, you ain't doing it right. And they seem like the guys who do it Batman style. <laughs> it's like, yeah, we're going to get that intel out of you one way or another. We're going to make you regret not telling us. <laughs> says, if the enemy is hoping to avoid conflict for now, our obvious move is to take the fight to them. It might be worth expanding our search at some point, even if that means fewer of us keeping the peace out in, on the streets. Just leaving them, bro. You got to make the hard choices. Like, fuck them. Fuck them. We got to find these guys. <laughs> So they just driving. I, I mean, that's pretty cool that they're all in the car, this dope ass car, driving around. I mean, that's also smart. So you're not like showing yourself in your presence, uh, just out here and about. Still on the move, kid. You're not getting much sleep. Says I recommend. I recommend a decent night's sleep in a warm, cozy bed. All might remember in Night Eye. It's like Night Eye. I. 
don't matter now, bro. <laughs> it don't matter now. So, like, what? It's, it's, I mean, as a, as a sensei, bro, as a sensei, have you even recommended Sleep to Deku? <laughs> Says what now? The kid's GPS signal is gone. Oh. That's not good. Says damn it. And then what the hell is that? There's a fucking canister. Ooh, an explosion. Oh no. Oh my, you're home. Deku. Look at shock. Something happened. What the fuck? What the fuck happened? What the hell just happened? Because Deku had something in his hand. I think it was the phone or the GPS. Yeah, his phone. And it just got shot. Yeah, it got shot by something. Hey, you. Says, hey, you. Boy in green. So, yeah, his phone just got shot by something. It's now stuck to the ground. I mean, stuck to the wall. Pierced through with this speaker of some sort. Or microphone. Says, you're coming with me. Deku's like, someone's here for me. Not just any old villain here randomly. They're specifically after me. Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> no! No! No, no. <laughs> no Deku. No, no, that gave me vibes of this motherfucker in the trenches. It's time. I've been waiting on this. Okay, okay, it's game time. It's game time. Here we go. Here we go. Out here pumping himself up, bro. Oh my god, everything else was practice. This is it's like it's time. It's time. Oh, oh it reminds me of uh, uh, that meme or whatever with Michael Scott, bro, from the office. It's like. <laughs> it's happening. It's happening. It's happening. <laughs> Send an escape you with ties to him. Come quiet. Oh! Come quietly. Uh, I remember her, bruh. And she was on the bottom level, bruh. Who's this that she just got laid out? Oh, that's. That's, uh. Ah, damn. It's. Was it Asaki? Chisaki. I thought he, I mean, she must have found his ass and said, nah, you coming with me, sucker. Nah, bro. Nah, bro, that ain't what you want. She's a killer, bro. Stone Cold Killer! <laughs> oh, no. Her cork is making weapons? Or a sniper out of hate? She's a badass. She's dope as fuck. Dad. Dad's fucking cool. That's fucking clean. Nah, bruh. When she ran out initially from the prison, I was like, mm, nah, she's down there and she look innocent. But then, then nah, she's down there for a reason. And this look says it all. She's a badass. Clean. Clean kill. <laughs> Sent by y'all for a higher gun. Sent by y'all for one, says Deku. With Chisaki. Oh, man. Oh, man. This is going to be great. <laughs> oh, man. No. It, it is happening. It is happening. Oh, no. Somebody. Somebody might not make it out of there. <laughs> I'm excited about that. But, hey, guys. Be sure to like, share, subscribe. Check out some of the other content on, on the channel. Pass that. Enjoy your Mother's Day. Have a great day.